everyone, welcome to the video. We're going to show you how to transfer Vortex, uh, the Vortex install of Mega Expanded Stardew into Stardrop. So download Stardrop, extract it somewhere, and uh, get it launched. Uh, you'll see a screen um, should eventually load up, and it should be populated with mods. So that means that Stardrop is, in fact, detecting your mods. So then what you want to do is actually close Stardrop, then go to your uh, mods folder in Stardew Valley, um, and you want to make a copy of the entire mods folder. doesn't matter where you're putting it, it's just temporary storage somewhere, and make a copy, do not move it. After you've made a copy, go into Vortex, which again, I don't have set up at the moment, so it's a little difficult to show you, but all you're doing in Vortex is stopping it from managing Stardew. So you would go to the Games tab, and you would go to Stardew Valley, and you would then change it to Stop Managing Stardew Valley. And then once that's finished running, uh, you can then take the copy of your mods folder that you made, uh, bring it back in here so you have all of your uh, original mods. Um, actually, I think I have it open still. Um, do I have it open still? I think I have it open still. If not, I should be able to get to it easy enough. Um, okay, where did I... Where did I store it? Oh, yeah, here. I've uh, just put it on my dump drive. <laughs> Um, so yeah, so I've got, uh, all the, a copy of the mods folder, uh, in here, and at the very, very bottom, uh, oh yeah, that's a bigger list than I think every time, uh, when selecting all of them to, uh, bring them back, um, don't select Vortex Deployment JSON, um, it's not necessary because we're not using Vortex, and it could potentially cause problems. And then once those are back in your mods folder, you can fire up Stardrop again. Um, it will probably require a little bit of setup. Uh, the main thing being that uh, SMAPI will not be installed. Um, so then what we need to do is... Alright, sorry about that. There was a an awkward thing happening on my side screen and I had to check it out, make sure it wasn't going to break everything. Uh, so anyway... We're going to need SMAPI, just download it uh, manually, and then run the installer appropriate to your operating system. It includes Windows, Linux, and Mac. Um, then once that's installed, Stardrop should be able to then launch using the SMAPI, uh, very similar to like how Vortex does it, and it should fire up and run the same as the Vortex install. And that's all you have to do to transfer it over to Star Stardrop. It's... Um, a little bit of work, but realistically, it's pretty simple. It's basically just a copy-paste. So, uh, yeah, that's everything you need to know for that. Hope you've uh, got whichever uh, mod manager you want up and running now. And I look forward to seeing you in-game. Bye for now.